Well, the, the diagnosis of cancer is a big sledgehammer. I was diagnosed with head and neck cancer in January of 2010. No matter how, where you're at in your life, you're going to know someone close that this is going to go through. And, and if we can keep it in the community, we can support it as a community, that means a lot. One of the things we've always hoped for is the ability to house as many services as possible for people facing cancer under one roof. With the leadership of our incredible donors that have been led by the philanthropy of Lance and Ellen Shainer, that we're finally in a space that is befitting of the care and competence that our caregivers have always provided, um, but most importantly is going to be able to serve the patients who are so deserving of well-coordinated care in a beautiful setting. It's always been a, a dream of mine and uh, the desire of the hospital administration to provide a more centralized location for the benefit and convenience of the patient so that they could come into one center and receive all or at least most of their care in one area. And I think with the uh, generosity of Lance and Ellen, that has made this cancer pavilion a uh, reality. So much thought has gone into the design of the Cancer Pavilion. When you walk through and you see these light infused spaces and recognize the amount of privacy that is now afforded to people, there is much to be thankful for that couldn't have happened without our donors. The people of this area should be extremely grateful to have this facility. Um, I've been here 38 years now and I've watched this facility grow and improve. It's a first class facility for cancer treatment. I can't see why anyone would have to leave this area for treatment. It's all right here now. One thing I liked about walking right into the Shainer Center was, was the openness of it, the airiness of, of it. It didn't give you that clinical feel. You must feel like you're walking in a hotel or a spa or something. You know, this is a friendly place. Uh, Center County is a very friendly place. These are friendly people, neighborhood people, and it's great to stay in the neighborhood. I've been to other cancer centers uh, in other cities and I think that the, the cancer pavilion that we have compares very favorably with those centers and as far as the physical plant I think it's a very beautiful physical plant and the equipment is state-of-the-art and uh, we're very proud to be able to uh, provide care in this wonderful new center. We know that there is no way we could be sitting in a facility of this magnitude if it weren't for these generous gifts. I've been so moved by the donors that I've talked to personally that have shared with me their reasons for wanting to contribute so generously to cancer care. But what we know is that the Lance and Ellen Shainer Cancer Pavilion is just a beginning, not an end. And we need every single person in our community to partner with Mountain Any Health to make sure that we can sustain our ability to provide these kinds of cutting edge services over the long term. I'm Kim and I'm here with Melissa. We simply want to extend our gratitude from the Foundation for Mountain Nittany Medical Center to our many donors for making this extraordinary facility possible. Thank you. Hi, my name is Eric Sweet and this is the Department of Radiation Oncology. We want to thank Lance and Ellen Shainer and the rest of the donors for this amazing facility. Thank, thank you. Hi Lance and Ellen. I know I'm speaking for myself and every one of us here at the Mountain Nittany family when we say thank you for your kindness and your generosity and all the things that you have done to make the Shainer Cancer Pavilion the reality that it is today. Words can't express how deeply grateful we are for all that you've done. So until they invent better words, I just want to say thank you from all of us at Mount Nittany. We think you're super and we love you a lot. Hi, I'm Marcia Winslow. I'm the nursing supervisor here. And on behalf of Dr. Ford and Dr. Powell's oncology practice, we would like to thank the donors for the Shainer Cancer Pavilion. Thank, thank you. you. Hi, I'm Aileen Galley from the Cancer Program, and I'm here with part of our team from Clinical Research, Cancer Registry, and Patient Navigation, and we want to say to all of our donors from the bottom of our hearts, thank, thank you. you.